okay and now I can write my own JavaScript okay and there we go so the first thing we will do is grab this doom object and to do that we are going to use the function dollar which is basically just the get element document that get element by id the javascript uh, function okay so we get that and what we will do is add a listener to it to this function observe observe so what we will observe is the click event and when the click event happens we will call the function with the parameter event and we are going to define the function here basically this will take care of the difference between the firefox add event listener and the ie attach event and also the uh, the difference between javascript in ie and in firefox regarding a passing arguments or parameters ie doesn't pass uh, the event which we uh, will trigger the function as a parameter and see that we put that in a global object called event okay so we don't care about that because we have our function which is defined in prototype which will take care of these differences between uh, browsers implementation of the javascript or the dom between browsers so okay let's now define some variables we will be using so, final result so we will it will be nothing we start the, uh, with an empty string and we need the user uh, string the shift value an index or a counter then a unicode character unicode variable which will hold a one character of a string so let's start by first grabbing the user string which will be just a dollar sign which basically is as we say document that get element by id and what id we want to get we want to get the dom object with the id text message so basically the message the user entered so we have the user uh, string we also need the shift value which is again so it's very simple using this dollar sign this function it's very nice text shift that's what we called it here I believe yeah that's it so text shift that value but we need uh, we need uh, an integer not uh, a character uh, a string so plus int so we are going to convert that to an integer okay we have the shift value we have the user uh, string which is the message now let's use a, uh, a for loop to go through each character of the user string inferior to user string that length i plus plus okay now what we will do is just grab each character we need code equals user string that char code at i so we have the character let's the encrypt that re uh, final result equals f result plus a string that uh, from char code 
so here here we will do the reverse of what we did here so we are going to convert from an integer to a character okay what we will convert in a code plus and shift value so basically here where the encryption the sample encryption happens okay so that's it when we and the for loop we will get our message encrypted so text result that's what i have called it here so text result that value equals f result this string here so that's it okay let me just save this so now if i try to execute this believe me i will get an error and uh, let's do that and i will explain to you why that so f12 it won't work so there we go if i go here and go cancel see that we have this error which uh, basically tells us that bit in encrypt is null so we didn't grab the button why that well because basically uh, javascript is an interpret interpreted language which mean it it gets interpreted line by line so it's exec not executed but interpreted by the javascript engine in the browser line by line so when uh, it executes this basically there is no button yet but because not the whole page has been loaded okay so to take care of that we need to add another function which is already in the the prototype library so ob observe ob there we, we could do that directly in javascript but we are going to use uh, the proto uh, prototype uh, syntax because it's more elegant okay so what uh, the we want to observe is the doom loaded event function so when that event occurs we are going to execute this function the following function which is basically all that is all that we have written until now okay so this way i am sure that this whole code won't get executed until the whole page is loaded until the home a whole uh, document object module is loaded okay so let's save this and execute with f12 okay now we are going to see just one error the last one so here i will type uh, hakim my name and for encrypt and there we go now if i want to decrypt this i do i just shift by minus four encrypt and there this we go okay what you will write here encrypt i want to decrypt the same gibberish here so there we go our program worked thank you